Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Jimmy Trico, also known as Horror Fan for Life. And the next movie I'm going to be reviewing is Servants of Twilight. This movie was released on May 1st, 1991. It is a horror film that has a 5.2 out of 10 on IMDb. The movie was directed and co-written by Jeffrey O'Brow and written by Stephen Carpenter. And the movie stars Bruce Greenwood, Belinda Bauer, Grace Sabrinsky, and Richard Bradford. And this movie is about uh, a private eye played by Bruce Greenwood who helps a woman uh, whose son has been paid as the next Antichrist by a cult leader uh, portrayed by Grace Zabrisky. And that's what this movie is about. This movie uh, was boring, generic. Um, there wasn't really any horror in it, in my opinion. I mean, it's uh, the only thing I can really say about this movie is, is I did what I did like what happened at at the end of the movie, but outside of that, this this was just another possession movie, uh, cult movie that's trying to you know sacrifice this kid and uh, it I don't know it was just I just didn't get into it. I didn't care about the characters. I, I didn't even care about the damn kid for all that matters, you know. And uh, I just really was invested in this movie. Um, the the lighting of this movie was poor as well and I, I just uh, I just I couldn't get into the movie it just uh, just wasn't for me maybe um, I caught this movie at the wrong time who knows but after watching it I, I, just, I couldn't wait for the movie to get over but as I said I did enjoy what happens at the end outside of that though this movie is just not a good one in my opinion um, the writing, directing, uh, wasn't all that good, and uh, the cinematography was pretty bad. So with that, I will give Servants of Twilight a 4 out of 10 and two thumbs down. Yeah, this this was a very disappointing movie to me. I was expecting much more, because I do love these movies that the, the kids are possessed, um, like The Omen, for example. Now, I've seen both the uh, original and remake, and I enjoy both. Uh, those are good examples of uh, how to do movies when it comes with possession uh, with a kid, you know, or he's the Antichrist, however you want to put it. Uh, so, yeah, if it was me, I'd skip this movie. Uh, if you want to watch it, by all means, but for me, I didn't like it. So, in the comment section below, if you've seen this movie, give me your thoughts and opinions. And did you enjoy it more than I did? Let me know. Let's have a great discussion about it. You know, let me know what you liked about it, what you hated about it, uh, and all that good stuff. But other than that, if you guys are new to the channel, subscribe today for more content. If you like this review, hit that like button. And don't forget to click the notification bell so you get all my videos that I upload to my channel, which I do on a daily basis. Unless I have company staying with me, which is normally my little brother, like this past weekend. So, but other than that, I thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for many more movie reviews, especially slasher horror genre. But thank you for watching, and check you later.